Okay, your turns in this example, we're looking at animals and how their weight and height compare. And it's shown to us on an X and Y axis graph here. So we can see weight's on the X axis and height is on the Y axis. Um, so height is in meters and weight is in kilograms. And so if we think of um, humans, first of all, well, humans are um, probably a, a little bit below two meters. So it's got to be one of these ones here. Um, so let's look at the weight of each of them, so that's a thousand kgs. So that one there is about 500 kgs, that one there is about 100 kgs. And so it's pretty easy um, to know that humans don't weigh 500 kgs. And so humans in this graph correspond to letter B. Okay, so what's C going to be then? Well C is something that's similar height to humans, um, but much heavier. So a cow is slightly shorter than us because they stand on four feet, but that would be roughly 500 kg. And so cows are the letter um, demonstrated by C. Okay, we've got this low one here, which is quite unusual, so that should be easy for us to pick. And the only thing that's short is a snake. And so there we go, A represents a snake. Um, and then something very tall, well, the tallest of all these animals, that's the giraffe. So D represents giraffe. And then E is the heaviest of all, and so that would have to be an elephant. So this is uh, a way that we can use X and Y coordinates to express um, a relationship between height and weight. Um, and yeah, it's, it should be pretty straightforward for you guys um, to, to make that relation. Um, anyway, I'd like you to have a go at 12.01 um, and make sure you check your answers after you've finished. Thank you.